Hi, I'm Zoe Lem, stylist and owner of My Sugarland, and today I'm going to give you some insider's tips on how to do fashion. So I'm now going to show you how to choose a kimono dress. So, two different ways to go. You can either go for something that's very, very authentic and going very, very in theme. It's going to look a bit out of place over here. So the best way to go is to go for a kimono style dress. It's got the wrap over, it's nipped in, and it's got the feel of the sleeves, but it's not an actual kimono. It's a flattering shape because generally a wrap dress is really good for hourglass, for straight up and down, and actually to give shape to um, a pear shape, to give the balance, give the balance through the shoulders. So, a very good dress for both day and night. A-line, nips in at the, underneath the bust, women's smallest bit. Flattering through here, cuts through the bust. So if you've got a bigger bust, again, chops through. So it's a really great shape. And the print on this and the satin, this is actually, um, this is Placid Parlour, and this is actually a vintage um, sari. So the shine in this fabric lifts the face. So it's a really great colour and a really great shine. Because this is getting a little bit closer to the face, whatever you wear here is going to reflect and brighten the eyes. A-line, the balance, the colours are really important when you're choosing a kimono. This is a great dress if you've got brown or green eyes because it's really warm, earthy colours. If you've got blue eyes, then going for purples or deep blues and jewelly tones is really good. Keep it away from cold colours. Keep them warm, keep them jewelly, um, and they're much more flattering because it's a lot of fabric, a lot of fabric through the arms, a lot of fabric close to the face, and that's going to make quite a difference to where it suits you. And keep it nipped in high and underneath the bust. And that's the way to choose the perfect kimono.